What did Aaron Boone think about the performance of Luke Boyd? Here's the manager's report brought to you by Geico. Aaron, how impressed have you been with Luke Voigt's consistency overall this season? Yeah, he's, I mean, <clears throat> he's been great. I mean, what an impact performer he's been. And uh, I'm glad he enjoyed his day off yesterday <laughs> so we can get him back out there twice tonight. Um, uh, yeah, just, I mean, really from, you know, going back to summer camp, I just felt like he was in such a good place in the batter's box, and he carried it right into the season. Hasn't stopped. Um, you know, obviously he's in great shape, and, um, you know, he's, you know, where would we be without him? He said on the field he wants to be out there every game if possible. It looked as though when he was running the bases, he was grimacing a little bit yeah. with some pain because the the foot stuff that's going on with him. How do you manage him? down this final stretch knowing how valuable he is to that lineup yeah just try and be mindful of it you know it's you know it, it was more an issue I think tonight with the wrap on his foot so they I just had to rewrap it it was kind of getting to him a little bit but um he's did, done a good job managing it um you know obviously it's not not affecting him a lot in the box so you know we'll just try and be uh try and take care of him as best we can when we can what did you like about the way Tanaka threw the ball you know what? I thought he got better as it went on. You know, the first few innings were kind of a grind for him. Um, you know, threw a lot of pitches. They made him work. They they fouled off a lot of pitches. I thought he used his whole arsenal really well. Um, we, we saw the curveball um, that he was able to flip in there. I thought he used his fastball really well tonight. Uh, I don't know what the percentages says, but it looked like he used his fastball a ton. And I thought he made some really big pitches with his split, um, you know, got a couple big outs with it, you know, when when an inning could have turned another way for him and um just overall I thought I thought he used his arsenal really effectively. Tom Merriam, you have the next question. Aaron, how big was this doubleheader sweep? It was it was a great start to this homestand. Um, you know, obviously Kind of getting off the schneid that last day in Baltimore or in Buffalo was big. Um, you know, obviously having a rough weekend last weekend in Baltimore, and you know, uh, you know, for Garrett to go out and set the tone for us and Massa back it right up and the bats to come through, this was you know an important day for us. Um, you know, but time to get past it and and another big one starting tomorrow. Jake Siner, you have the next question. In the, uh, the first inning there with DJ and Luke, there's a few uh, really aggressive base running decisions that paid off. I'm curious, was that uh, something they decided for themselves? Was that a game plan going in? Yeah, that was it was a great job because that's not an automatic read there. And, and obviously, um, you know, DJ making the decision to go, not only is, um, you know, he moved himself up, but no, knowing he could bring the trail runner with him and – Luke did a good job of, of following him, and it, and it set up, a, it, you know, perhaps set us up for a really nice inning on an aggressive decision there by DJ. Back to Meredith. Aaron, we've asked you so much about the offense over the last two and a half weeks. What do you think has been the biggest difference with the offense as a whole over the last three games? Um, Again, I'll even go back to four games, you know, when we didn't score a lot of runs, but I felt like I really saw the at-bats starting to improve. We didn't get the results in that second game in Buffalo. But I just felt like more guys um, were having quality at-bats. And then, obviously, we carried it in that last day, Buffalo, and then here. Um, you know, and, and the more guys that are having quality at-bats, the more pressure pitches they've got to make. Um you know, the tougher situations you put them in, you know, and ultimately <clears throat> we've been able to take advantage of some of the traffic we've started to create. We've gotten some big hits, obviously, Luke with a couple big homers today with, with a couple guys on. So um, I just feel like up and down we're putting more pressure on them uh, top to bottom.